on, bless the name of the Lord. Remain standing for the Old Testament reading, Pastor Carlos Christian, and the New Testament reading, Elder Anthony M. Wilson. Let's say amen for them as they come. Reading from the number 103rd Psalms. Behold how good and pleasant it is for brethren to dwell together in unity. It is like the precious ointment upon the head that ran down upon the beard, even Aaron's beard, that went down to the skirts of his garments. As the dew of Harmon and as the dew that descended upon the mountains of Zion, for there the Lord commanded the blessings even life forevermore. In the word of the Lord is blessed. First Corinthians, the fifteenth chapter, the fifty first verse. Behold, I show you a mystery. We shall not all sleep, but we shall all be changed. In a moment, in the twinkling of an eye, at the last trump, for the trumpet shall sound, and the dead shall be raised incorruptible, and we shall be changed. For this corruptible must put on incorruption, and this mortal must put on immortality. So when the corruptible shall have put on incorruption, and this mortal shall have put on immortality, then shall be brought to pass the saying that is written, death is swallowed up in victory. O death, where is thy sting? O grave, where is thy victory? The sting of death is sin, and the strength of sin is the law. But thanks be to God, which giveth us the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. Therefore, my beloved brethren, be steadfast, unmovable, always abounding in the work of the Lord. For as much as ye know that your labor is not in vain in the Lord, the word of the Lord is blessed. Shall glory unto the Lord. Amen. You may be seated in the presence of the Lord.